How's it hanging, fellow Samoros? And this is another episode of Grand Theft Auto the Trilogy. And in today's episode, oh, what is wrong with my with my analog stick? Hold on. Oh, my analog stick was just like not pressed in. It was like pulled out a little bit for some reason. All right, I, I thought my fucking controller broke for a second. That'd be a bummer. I mean, not that PS5 controllers are that expensive, they're as expensive as any other controller from the first party, you know? You know what, towards the end of like PS4's life cycle, I saw a lot more like third party PS4 controllers showing up. And I was really hoping that that would be the case all the time, because I think... I really like third party controllers, because not only is it like something kind of different to hold into your hands, but on PS2 I had like a whole fucking bag of... Uh, third party controllers. I had one with like fucking Yoda on it and it was like a tiny fucking PS2 controller and I really liked that one because my original PS2 controller broke when I had a PS2 so then my dad bought me like a whole bag of third party controllers and half of them had a thing where like this button didn't work on the other controller this button didn't work. We're flying to CJ's mission by the way. I don't remember why I finished in the hangar but I did and fuck it. And yeah, I think it was themed around the prequels, because it had Yoda on it, and that was around that time. And another thing... Yeah, so the Yoda one, I think, was the only one that worked. I remember that when you had it plugged in, Yoda's head like lit up a little bit. Like, with green. Shouldn't his lightsaber light up? That'd be cool. But anyway, and... Yeah, PS3 also had that, but I didn't have as many. I had one that had this fucking awful rubber texture that the last time I seen that controller the rubber on it just became so fucking sticky with age that's like the worst fucking possible thing to put on a fucking electronic I had a mouse that had the same issue where it had like a rubber on it but with time that rubber kinda like just became really sticky and completely fucking untouchable it was so disgusting to fucking hold and that controller had it too but that controller was cool I liked it even though it was broken, because it broke, but that's the thing about these third-party controllers. They're not as sturdy and good as the first-party controllers, but... But the thing is... Oh my god, my fucking lamp turned itself on again. I fucking hate this fucking lamp. I'll toss it out the fucking window soon. But the thing is, it's always the controller I would, like, give my friends when they would come over, because I don't want them to, like... Like I, it's not like I want them to, you know, play with the shitty controller. It's just that I don't want to... I want this controller to be used as little as possible. So it's kind of like an occasional controller my friends would use. So that then... You know, I wouldn't have to spend so much money on an official first-party controller that would only be used occasionally when my friends would come over. Not to mention, there's not really any controllers on PS5 that look any, any cool. There's like reskins. I think there's like an orange one that kind of looks nice. I don't have uh, Kevlar. See what I was saying? I wish it was like an turn itself on again, off again. I wish it was like in GTA 3 or Vice City where you collect these collectibles and then it just gives you weapons and armor in your hideout. But it doesn't do that. It's pissing me off. Hello, boss man. Taking care of business, I see. Or are you jealous? Oh yeah, we did the plane mission. That's why I was on the hangar. What's wrong with your face, Torino? You know I'm tired of your fucking little job. Ah, will you stop? This is pathetic. Come on, you're embarrassing yourself. Come on, put it down. Don't be ridiculous, okay? Hey, I got a little surprise for you here. You ready for this? Huh? Answer it. That's nice. What is it? Is it sweet? Better not be sweet. Hello? Oh, God damn it, sweet. I fucking hate you. Alright, you hold tight, I'll be right there. Alright. So what was that little job you What the fuck about? happened to my torso? I just want you to go pick up your brother. Get out of here. My pants went through my shirt. Jesus Christ, can you not even get a cutscene right, you fucking thing? Should have taken a should have taken a screenshot of that. Ooh, a bike. I pressed triangle expecting him to get to the car, but here we are in a bike. Yeah, pretty close to the end of the game. Oh, fuck this. 
making a, my jet back much faster. And what the fuck I was talking about? Bootleg controllers? So yeah, PS4 finally started having those and I don't really need them anymore. What I would like to have is a bootleg PS5 controller, perhaps, or a, for, or a second party, kind of like a cheaper alternative, maybe. I feel like with PS5 controllers, it's gonna take a while for these to happen, because the PS PS5 controller is probably, like, I dare to say, most advanced controller on a, on a console right now. Unless PC has some really fancy controllers with, like, some fancy schmancy fucking bullshit built in. Yeah, but I kind of missed the big light on the back of the PS4 controller because it actually did make like the atmosphere when you're sitting in a dark room. Oh, there's a helicopter up there. When you're sitting in a dark room and just kind of like... Like you can use the controller as a source of light. I need a vehicle to pick up sweet. Well, I saw a really nice vehicle on top of the police department. Is this gonna count? Sweet, I'm gonna pick him up in my own private police jet. I mean, helicopter. SAPD. Now, I was also talking about, in my last video that I recorded, not of Grand Theft Auto, but episode 6 of Book of Boba Fett. You know what I figured out? They should have really called this series something other than Book of Boba Fett. If they called it Book of Tatooine, for example, which I was thinking, because like, the series mostly takes place in Tatooine, you could have called it Book of Tatooine, and then it would have made more sense be that Bo up, that bro? Boba Fett kind of disappeared hey, up, from man? two episodes. Because right, hey, it's man. not a show about him Yo, now, spot. it's more of a show about Mantis, citizens of of Tatooine, Shit, which Boba Fett is. We got a stake in the casino. We got some insane shit in Fierro. But because it's called it Book of Boba Fett, man. everybody everybody's hey, biggest complaint is like, where the close, fuck is bro, Boba bro. Fett? Nigga, what the fuck is this bullshit? Fuck you! I hate you so fucking you much. Mean, What's mine is yours, and you know that. You never did get a ditchy car. I need what? to go check on things in the hood. Man, in the, the fucking problem. hood. You're always a perpetrator, running from what's real. What's fucking real? Our hood. Up there. You don't want to be in Who the, the hood? fuck cares no, about the that's hood? Exactly where I want to be. What you done for our hood? Man, what the hood done for me? Always dragging me down. Yeah, fucking exactly. I fucking hate Sweet in this fucking game. He's the worst. The man, it's like he doesn't like even right doesn't even fucking listen to him. I sound right, like man. smoke right now because I have bigger oh, aspirations than be a fucking street gangster. CJ, I, you you. Shit's all up now, dude. I can't yeah. I, I can't accelerate for some reason. No Just take me to CJ, I want your ass. Hold on, I gotta dildo this sign. Oh shit, I dildoed it out of existence. Alright, get back in. It's like, where the fuck you got a helicopter? See? Everything's fixed. Fucking sign got in my way. I got a new helicopter. Yeah, Cat Bane shows up. And another thing I realized about that scene with Cat Bane, so a couple of things I noticed about it that not many people pointed out, is Cat Bane shoots with his left hand. Which I don't think he's left-handed. I remember him shooting with his right hand usually. This looks kind of nice. When like I'm in the air, but I'm not high enough to notice how small the map is. The map actually looks really nice. Like with all the palm, palm trees and shit. That's nice, kind of. Look, guys, we're back on growth street. Back when it all fucking started. Back when this fucking let's play of this shitty ass game fucking started. I hate this game. Don't play it. Don't buy it. Maybe play it if you get it for free, but don't fucking buy it. Ryder's dead, by the way, sweet. Hope you're happy. We never brought him up again because I don't know if Ryder even existed at this point. I'm pretty sure he's a ghost. And this hey, chopper just yo, ruined yo, this cutscene. It's, it's really good. It's, it's, it sort of works. Man, what the fuck? That's Miles Blender. Look like base heads and took over the spot. Let's go home. Base heads? This is home, man. Fuck this home, oh, man. You was born in there. You stuck in the past. Fucking dumbass, idiot. Kill any crack dealers in your hood to keep gang healthy. Yeah, then fucking invite vitamin dealers to keep them even healthier. 
Ah, fuck, look at that, guys. The whole map's been taken over by the ballas. Not a single piece of the map is even green. Even the areas that were green before are not green anymore. I'm pretty sure the, Vag uh, the Aztecas areas were also taken over by Vagos. Stop talking about Grove Street. I'm sick of hearing about it. Grove Street home. Well, I didn't mean to trigger a gang war, but sure. GSF for life. What's the money from this crack dealer? Oh, you know what sucks? We lost our... The MP, MP4 that I'm carrying right now only appears around the Dragon Palace Casino. So now if I want to pick it up again, I gotta go all the way back to the fucking casino or I can just use an AK. And the shooting in this game fucking sucks. What's cool about the gang taking over territory thing is at least it gives you health pickups throughout it, so you, you're not completely fucked. All this money disappeared. Where are the ballers? I see them on the mini-map. I ran out of ammo for it, are you fucking kidding? Survive the second wave. That's not what I meant to do. I meant to fucking. One of the ballers is up there. Are they all approaching from up there? Oh shit. Sweet, you fucking moron. You I'm pretty life, convinced huh? you fucking don't have a brain, you piece of fucking shit. That fucking head grew into your fucking skull. That stupid ass green fucking stuck in the past fucking head. I almost died. Alright, man, let's get out of here and go see Ken. Kendall can come see me right here at her home. But it ain't it's your fucking house, home. idiot. Rome wasn't built in a day, nigga. My brother could be a real pain in the ass. I fucking hate Sweet Man. He's such a piece of shit. All right, let's go. It's that infamous glitch everybody saw before, except for everybody else it triggered at the beginning of the game. Where apparently somebody just takes Ryder's car and then fucking takes it and runs people over with it. Well, I guess now we have a conclusion to what happened to Ryder's car after he died. Oh, nice, thanks. All for free. Was taken away by some fucking crazy drug addict that, that almost ran me over. Unless they're still crack dealers. Oh, you real calm. Haven't I made a, enough of a fucking slaughterhouse out of this neighborhood for you to figure out you don't fucking hang out here, you piece of shit? Show me what you got. Also, we unlocked a new gun store. Which, stupidly, for some fucking reason, is not unlocked until now. I really don't get it. Who the fuck is this? Who, what the fuck Hello, do they want? Hello, baby. I thought I called to say how much I love Claude? Who's Claude? Nah, Catalina. It's Carl. I think you got the wrong number. Oh, Carl. Uh, so sorry. It is such an easy mistake to make. Especially when I am so light-headed with love and lust. Yeah, well I... Uh, no time. Uh, bye. Where is my... No, it's still on the map. All right. Mr. Whoopi. Fuck you. i to whoop your ass, bitch. Yeah, so I was talking about Cat Bane's appearance, and, uh... Another thing I realized is that Cat Bane comes over to that fucking town of Freetown, I think it's called, right? He comes there to convince the citizens not to join Boba Fett. He says that Boba Fett is a killer and a psychopath. They shouldn't join him. They should just give up and allow the drugs to be, you know... De ...dealt in their area, and they will be left alone. It's obviously a lie, because sooner or later, like, they might be left alone at first, but sooner or later, you know, the Pikes will try to 
I don't know, utilize all the fucking... All of, uh... Tatooine for the drug deals, and probably every single little village in Tatooine will be taken over. You know what? Uh, this episode's how long? 15 minutes? Let's do racing for the rest of the episode, because what I want to do... This looks kind of weird. Lowrider race? Haven't we done this before? Yeah, I did. Oh, it actually counts. I can redo that race that we did at the very beginning of this game. That's interesting. Wow, this one looks fucking stupid. Is it a bike race? I mean, like, I thought like a bicycle race more, not like a bike race like this. So what was I talking about? Oh, why are the checkpoints so far away? I was totally expecting to have to go forward. I should have put another checkpoint in there. What the fuck, man? Jesus. Yeah, but with the fucking... With the way he shot the sheriff and killed the deputy, he's obviously making the fucking town of Freetown not work with the planks and not listen to them. But now they're gonna join Boba Fett. Like, you can't be... I don't believe that Cad Bane didn't foresee something like that. Cad Bane kind of works two steps ahead of everybody. It's kind of his thing. That's why he's such a good bounty hunter. He always has a plan and is like a step ahead. But like... In this case, like, you gotta be... Like, I got a feeling there's like some alternative motive he has to have. To piss off the town of Freetown just to... To piss everybody off just to kind of like... Get them not on his side. That's a really cool bike I have, unfortunately. I don't have it unlocked anywhere. Back Road Wanderer. I don't want to trigger too many missions because at some point in the story there are, there's a mission where it just tells you like oh too bad you can't access this mission because you don't have enough territory taken over by the growth street and I'm like I fucking hate that not to mention you have to take over like most of Los Santos to do that whoa whoa fuck shit what the hell you don't have to take over all of it but I kind of want to do that anyway just to, just to prove that I did Man, I'm losing. How the fuck? Oh, I see how the fuck. I'm fucking last. No, oh, no, I'm not. Still not first, though. The way ahead. It's a one lap race all the time. That's kind of weird, these races here. Now, maybe I'll make another episode today, because I was kind of thinking like, alright, two episodes and a gameplay and such. I still have one more to make. But now I can't really think about... I mean, I know it's a sweet mission that forces you to like... You know, start fucking... Oh, Jesus Christ, I felt so... So bad. Whoa, watch, shit. Fuck me. Race can't go any worse, I might as well give up. I lost already, fucking shit. Can't even see my opponents, they're obviously fucking rigged. What a rigged fucking staged race. My bike probably doesn't work right. I was lagging, and the other guys are cheaters. My ping went up, and I'm pretty sure I, I, I'm winning, but it just doesn't register correctly. You gotta be kidding me, guys. I'm actually catching up. Fucking hell. Ah, oh, gee, no. Well, there we go. I might get to give up. Nice, nice, nice race we had. Gonna wait here for 20 seconds. Yeah, so what do you think? Cad Bane did this on purpose or not? That he pissed off everybody in this town just to not be on his side? Like, is his plan maybe to... Like, is he actually working against the pikes? I mean, I'm, I know it kind of sounds like I'm just being a fanboy of Cad Bane, which I am. And I'm like, oh, Cad Bane's actually a good guy. He's going to join Boba Fett. No, but I also kind of don't want him to die because I've been thinking about... They brought him to live action. He looks fucking awesome. And you know what? I was thinking, it really does kind of... Shows you that Book of Boba Fett is nowhere nearly as... Ah, my... Fuck off. Nowhere nearly as liked as Mandalorian because you don't see like mainstream memes 
on it. You know, where it's like somebody takes a shot out of the show and turns into some shitty template. Like the one where Mando is like aiming a sniper rifle and Baby Yoda sitting next to him. Or the one where like he fights the girl character who I forgot the name of, who they fired from Disney because of her some... I don't know what the fuck she said, I don't remember, but she was edgy on Twitter or whatever and then they fired her and I guess her character is gone now. And a lot of people were upset about that, but I was like, I don't care, I don't like her character to begin with. I don't even like Baby Yoda, I kind of watched Mandalorian for Din Djarin, really. He's my favorite part of it. That's a hard race, I can't believe these fuckers are keeping up with me. Usually I win in first 10 seconds and then I just stay first. What the fuck, sh fuck man? I told you this fucking race is rigged, somebody got paid, o paid off to fucking block the road for me. Not to mention all these fuckers who are keep bumping into me. And all these fucking light poles, they, they weren't there before. Somebody put them there for me to crash into them. Some bullshit. How am I second? I was first the whole time. Game lag. Nice. I was lagging. And they're cheating. I should have won. So this fucking turn. You gotta be kidding me how I punch I got fucked over. Now I'm gonna lose again? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Second. died. Probably crashed to death. Fucking piece of shit. I thought I quickly would do take care of these racing and that's it. Any women in these races. Good for them, good for them. Fucking hell. Got a, they got a better bikes than me, that, that's it. That's why I'm losing. And my bike is jumping. I think someone rigged my bike, guys. Oh, I hope you fall over, die, and fucking break your neck, piece of shit. Fair competition. I'm a very competitive, fair person. I don't wish anybody death or anything edgy like that. Fuck off or I'll shoot you. Wanna get blasted, you bitch? Oh, look, and now all of a sudden, she heard me. She got spooked. Can't lose against a girl. What the fuck, man? Oh, all, all the boys on the playground will make fun of me. They will call me gay. And I can't have that, that will be the end of me. Oh shit. See what I'm fucking saying? I'm actually kind of... Unironically complaining right now, my bike is just like... I'm turning and then my bike turns more than I want. And it's pissing me off. Maybe because of the terrain, the street is kind of bumpy. Maybe I should get off the bike and just run. I wonder if you could... No. I don't think they allow you to go through any checkpoints unless you're on a bike. Fucking shit. They're not catching up, are they? Yeah, Cat Bane's great. I love Cat Bane. One, third, I may think he's my third favorite Star Wars character. With second being Ahsoka. And first being Darth Maul. Actually, speaking of Darth Maul, I, I think Cat Bane and Darth Maul actually worked together in the events before the Phantom Menace. Where Darth Maul had like a mission where he needed to go and kill a Jedi Padawan to prove himself as a worthy, worthy student to Palpatine. So he heard of a... Oh my god, there's a lot of these fucking races still. So he heard of a Padawan. Oh, this one should be easier. I said that as I'm about to die and probably fucking get killed. I like racing on open highways like fucking asshole. I'm gonna kill these fuckers. So what he did? Fucking piece of shit. Fucking subhuman trash. Bumped into me and almost got me killed. Why are they driving on the other side of the road? Motherfucker. 
couldn't stop for any other fucking moment. Alright. Calm and collective. I'm winning. What the fu- oh, no. Piece of shit. I can't with you, fuck you. Fucking asshole. Bumping into me and shit. Bump into me any other fucking time. Go ahead, but not fucking now. I'm fucking racing. And then change fucking lanes for no reason. Fucking piece of shit. I fucking... I already spoke plenty about how much I hate them fucking doing that all the time. Also, these checkpoints really do cover up all the fucking cars coming ahead and kind of... Maybe I should just not drive on the left side of the fucking road. Maybe that's my mis biggest mistake. See what I mean about the placement of these checkpoints? I actually got a little bit like... Like what if I... Wrongly assumed which turn should I have taken right now? Yeah... What else about Cat Bane? So I was like saying... So they brought him to live action, he looks awesome in my opinion. Some people complain about him. But no, I think he looks awesome. And... I kinda don't want him to die now in the next episode. Because that seems like what the setup, right? You know, Boba Fett and Cat Bane always get a rivalry going on. And I'm like, why did Cat Bane went came out of retirement? I guess he had to be had to get paid a lot of money and maybe he his retirement money ran out. So he had to. Perhaps. So is he here to reclaim the title of the best bounty hunter or what? Why did he give me this fucking car? What the fuck? Fucking killed somebody. What is wrong with these people? They never drove a car before? It's just like children sitting in these cars. They can't reach the pedals. Oh fuck. Maybe I'm a child too. I wonder how well they do in a race. Like a car race. I'm, I'm not really... I don't think I ever overtook anybody on like a... Whoa, what the hell? He disappeared. Why is the game lagging so much? Jesus Christ. And why are the cars disappearing right in front of me? And why is that guy... Ha ...has a faster car? What an asshole. See, the skill of... ...squeezing through fucking cars all of a sudden comes in handy. Uh-oh. Fine, I'm fine. Just gotta, you know... Oh, shit. No way I'm getting back up there. Fuck, even he's like desperate. Well, that's it. That's the that, that death of me. Very nice. What? Hold on, I meant to blow up, not fucking do nothing. Your fucking bike too fucking suck. I have been disqualified. How come? I fuck you with this fucking race. It's crazy. Pissing me off. How long is this episode? Guess I should continue doing racing in the next episode. And there you go, we got stuff to do next episode, then we can do some more missions, and next episode won't be boring. And I'll do some stuff in it. What are they talking about? Cat Bane, I guess. Oh yeah, and I saw a lot of edits of the Cat Bane appearance. I think my favorite was Sad Bane. Where Cat Bane is just sad. Or, or Cat Bane with a nose. Or, or the one where Cat Bane is Darth Maul. Oh, I'm wanted during this race. That's beautiful. An additional challenge, because I, I like challenging myself. Maybe if I can... Like bully the fuck out of this guy, he will just like spin out of control. Kind of look, kind of what I expected. I was kind of hoping he'd die. This is a horrible fucking street, man. You go a little fast, and then all of a sudden you go flying. You know what? I don't think we ever explored these neighborhoods, the, the these houses and stuff. This is why I was saying like. 
San Andreas stories could utilize like a lot of areas that we've never been to. I think in like 20 years, San Andreas will like resurface in the news and people will be like, a fan-made mod called San, and oh, sorry, San Andreas Stories was released. That would have been kind of really cool. Like, you often hear stories of like a mod being in development for like 10 fucking years or something. Like, for example, the Mafia 1 uh, to Titanic, I think, was in development for like 13 years. Where somebody tried to recreate the Titanic in Mafia 1. And there's like a submission. Like a, like a whole separate... It's kind of like a DLC taking place on the Titanic. Like, what if Tommy actually went on the Titanic? And I think the creators of the mod actually intend to make it a full story. Like, who? Cool. Is Tommy gonna be the new Jack? Fuck off. How come police can shoot pistols out of a bike, but I can't? That's the dumbest thing about this fucking game. Why can't I shoot pistols out of vehicles? But SMGs are fine. My opinion, SMG should be even harder to shoot out of a car or a bike. You think about it, I should be able to shoot a fucking shotgun out of a bike. But nah, that'd be that'd be too cool. That'd be fun. Can't have that. Let's try doing one more race, like successfully, without fucking it up. Maybe I'll pull it off. Maybe I won this. Two more races. Or, I should just get the fuck back home, my helicopter's gone. Oh, but my wanted level is in, very fucking nice. I'm sorry, Vago ball of pool. What the fuck's going on? Is, this the, is it the riot? The riot's triggered it? I think it should. I don't think I've ever seen this car before. It's kinda cool looking. Also, I think there's something here you can access. It's like this... Guy with like a really ominous fucking red light behind him. He summons the demons. Alright, I'm gonna go to this safe house. I'm gonna quickly make our fucking way over there. Buy the place, because I'm rich, I don't care. And fucking save in it, because I fucking swear to god. About to die. Can't catch me, police. I'm in my private property. Don't even think about bumping into my car. Now oh, you piece of shit. You did it anyway. Told you not to do it. You had to fucking go ahead and do it. What a beautiful house. I wouldn't think that such a nice house would be purchasable in such a fucking ghetto-looking place. This fucking door frame's kind of weird. It's like there's something in the way. Look. Yeah, there's a glitch. It's like something in my way right now. That's great. See you fellas in the next episode. Bye.